This silence makes me want to whistle the Andy Griffith tune. Except that I won't. It would be a real dick move to do a fake out. Oh, there's Mr. McBlunt Edge. They're all misters. You know, I would not like to imagine a Dr. McRapey. I think Mr. is fine as is. Hey, found a battery. Don't mm -hmm. fucking reload. It's like he sees you, but he doesn't see you. What the fuck is he holding? Is he holding like a piece of plank? Shit, he found the key. Dun, 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 dun. The sad part is, is I'm the one commentating. Yeah, I know, I'm sitting here freaking losing my freaking mind. <laughs> Do tell. We're all ears. Uh huh. You were such an asshole. That's me. Well, that dude is gone. Careful, he's behind you. Obviously, none of them bothered to get their medical license. Well, medical license has nothing to do with it when they leave out the Hippocratic Oath. First, do no harm. That's what Medic and TF2 did. He completely disacknowledged the Hippocratic Oath. Because he would be a hypocrite. Oh, 
those goddamn birds. <sighs> you made it. Now back to climbing stairs. Well, hypocrites have Oh, become... shit. What? <laughs> Oops. Oh, you fell. Well, you can jump up there, just so you know, so don't stop trying or else you're going to frustrate yourself. Oh, yeah, I know. I could jump up there. There we go. Got it. Well, the thing with hypocrites is, is what it's become today was not exactly what it used to be. Hypocrites was actually a form of medical study people. Hence the term hypocritic. Oh. Please don't be on the table again, kitty. She probably is. Follow the blood. Hey, we got that message again. Where is he getting? Well, never mind. That's a stupid question. I shouldn't ask where he's getting all that blood from. <laughs> Mr. McCrape, he's given him a fresh supply of all the decap decapitated heads and bodies. Another oh, battery! Yay! Don't press the reload button. <laughs> that motherfucker's right there. Don't fall. You know you could have probably crawled on that ledge, right? Actually, I won't fall on that ledge. I said crawl on it, not fall. Oh, oh I'm sorry. That's okay. This is gonna be a Archimedes. tough one! Ah. Got it. Stupid bird. Hey, Satan has joined the chat. Oh, come on, no role playing. Get back in exe dot whatever fucking video what? upload. I can't English. How do you grammar? I haven't Englished all day. Back up to ten batteries. Back up to ten, you said. Yep. Let's see how long that'll last. Probably not very long. Oh shit. Oh, there we go. Got him. Out. I was something hoping something would have been behind that door. Hey, battery. Oh, wow. Okay, so I just wasted picking up a battery. Now I know that. When there's two batteries grouped up there, it, it'll actually take both batteries. Huh. Eh, you learn something every day. True. No idea where I'm going. That makes two of us. Ooh, there's a file. I haven't seen one of these in a bit. Excerpt from the diary of Shirley Pierce, Mount Massive Mental Hospital patient 195 or 19. I'm sorry, Mount Massive Mental Hospital patient 1952 to 1964. I thought it was actually a serial number. How can I not remember where the cuts are coming from? They hurt so deeply, even days later. Dr. Newhouse tells me that it's my fault. I'm, sub I'm subconsciously resisting the hi hypnotherapy. 
but I want so much to get better. I don't know how I could be doing this to myself. Dr. Newhouse says it's another condition of my bedroom inspired hysteria. Really? Poor Bruce, I make him suffer so. I've tried, subtly, to ask Mrs. Jackson if she had if she's had similar issues with her husband, but she is but she is loath to talk about it. Okay, grammar. Her husband, too, has found comfort in a younger woman. Oh. Ew. Dude, you're boned. I know the doctors only meet... What the fuck? Give me my... F there we go. I know the doctors only mean well, and with the help of the government men who join the staff, I am in very best hands... I am in the very best hands possible. I should just take my pills and sleep, and hope for more pleasant dreams tonight. Ah... Uh. <laughs> that one was, you promised me a rose garden. Why does it sound familiar? It sounds like it's in reference to something. Can I search it? Hey, yeah, good. Fuck that! I know I saw something out of the corner of my fucking eye cross. Uh uh. No. Oh, no. Fuck you. Oh, perfect. I have to go that way. There's no battery over here. Fuck. I'm like used to seeing cameras and shit. You got like plenty of batteries right now. I know, but okay. There's the now battery. Now you're just right pouring them. Hey, listen. Okay, I I I would rather know where all my batteries are at, so when I really need them, I could just go pick one up. Good to know where your assets are. It says lie. It's a note. Lies. I recognize the handwriting. Father Martin killed a man here. Are the lies he's talking about all the files missing from these boxes? The facts? The records? They look like government agency material. At least 30 years old. Probably older. I start thinking, uh, McCultra CIA mind control, the buzzing won't stop. Okay. I somehow like where this is going with the mind control theory shit. Well, that's nice. Remind me to never piss you off. What? Mind control? <laughs> Oh, God. <laughs> Would it freak you out to know that uh, that there are lots of things I know? Oh, hey! Oh. No! Oh, no, 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 no. Betty didn't know that. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, he killed me. He killed me first strike. Oh, God. He's naked. He is so naked. He killed me first fucking strike. You know what? I'm sorry. Well, at least it was painless. It's because he had a penis. What? He got the shaft. Shut up! Ah, ah, God. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> You're dead. <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> Not necessary. Wow. And through the shaft. Jesus. Uh. <sighs> oh, that was well played, sir. Yeah, I bet. Seems legit. Completely legit. Excuse me while I take it a little bit of nicotine from that scare. <laughs> I th it was it was just the scare that put you off. Oh, shadow. Fuck off. 
Actually, how did you sleep Sunday night? <laughs> I slept Probably like a baby. I, uh, he had that much alcohol in him. Oh yeah, I was I was hungover. Yeah. I, oh, I knew you were. Oh, I you were oh, I was hungover. You want to know how bad? I had to ride my bike into work that morning, and I was hungover. Oh, it was bad. Well, you poor thing. Exercise is good, you fat fuck. <laughs> I'M LIKE THE LATEST WEIGHT OUT OF EVERYBODY IN SP, YOU JACKASS! How much you weigh? 125 pounds, and I'm 6 I'm feet lighter. tall. I'm 6 feet tall. Okay. I'm 5 foot 10 and 120. Okay. I'm 6 feet tall. So, in all reality, I am lighter than you for my size. You're 6 feet... Eh. Massimo's gonna feel so bad. He's the shortest person in SP. Massimo's gonna headbutt you in the balls. Oh shit, he does have a dick hanging there, okay. God damn that's you! Nice. That's lovely. So let me ask you this question, how tall is... Massimo? He's I shorter than us. I don't know, yeah, he's, he's shorter than us and Rob and I are about the same height. I'm gonna say like 5'5", five 5'6". Foot five, five foot Good god, he's short. <laughs> I'm gonna pet him on the head. <laughs> I, I really want to hug him when he gets here, because I want to hug everybody, I'm and gonna it's going to be really it. awkward, because I'm going to be a, re a lot taller than him. I am 5 foot 8, barefoot. I think Tom's just about as tall as him. <laughs> oh, poor Massimo. <laughs> At least I won't feel short now. You're gonna have to be around him the whole time. Wow. That's kind of you. Everything. That's that's totally kind of you.